Fellas, each of you could take this. Just what's the mindset of the team right now? Obviously, it's kind of a clean slate going the tournament, but is, are there any bad feelings, any residual feelings from the Vanderbilt loss? Mm-hmm. Um, obviously, it was a tough loss, but um, I mean, we got to put it behind us now, and it's, it's like SEC tournament time, so we're all really excited to get that going. And um, <clears throat> me and Mike have been here for a couple of years, kind of know what to expect a little bit, um, but for some of the new guys and guys that it's their first time playing the SEC, um, it's really, really exciting to see. It's going to see how, how they do as well. <clears throat> yeah, like Justin said, tough loss, but it's clean slate now, so got to go full steam ahead and just be ready for the next game. Mike, Frank kind of talked about being frustrated with the defensive performance over the last two and a half weeks, three weeks or so. What's been the biggest issue for you guys defensively, and how do you go about correcting it these three days leading up to the tournament? Um, yeah, we just got to be more aggressive. Uh, got to, I feel like at some points we were able to go, not hand check as much, but uh, recently we got, have gotten back to that. So fouling them a lot or fouling the opponents a lot. Uh, just got to get back to how we were a few weeks ago. I, I guess for you guys, what what is that like preparing to sort of have all those games potentially back to back? And what is that? You know, turnaround like when you, you you might play late at night and then you know play the early afternoon the next day. Uh, from experience, I can say that it's tough. It's tough to go from jump from one game to another, but at the same time, we're not trying to focus on that. We're trying to focus on winning the next game. You know, so we're going to win the the game against whoever it is, Arkansas or Vanderbilt, and then we'll, we'll worry about LSU. Justin, how are you feeling a couple of days removed from your first game back in, in a few weeks? Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, I'm, I feel really good. Um, I went, I, had, I was with Mark yesterday and got my treatment. It was, it was really good. Um, it just felt good to be back out there and and uh, to be able to just play again. And <clears throat> uh, it went really good. I got that, that splint that I'm wearing and that helps protect it and help, just helps me be able to play. Is there any mental barriers you have to try and break down, given um, that you're coming back from that injury? Yeah, and obviously yeah. Obviously, you got uh, to shoot with it. Mm-hmm. Definitely, uh, there definitely are some mental barriers. Um, but the splint I'm wearing, I can't move my thumb. So I kind of had to get used to that to kind of be able to play with that. And um, yeah, but once I, I, once the game really started, um, I really wasn't thinking too much. I was kind of just out there playing. So it's not, it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. <clears throat> This is Justin. This is sort of a follow up on that, but what is it like shooting with that splint on? <laughs> yeah, um, it's definitely at first it's definitely a challenge because um, you can't kind of use your, you need your thumbs kind of to shoot the ball. But um, I don't know. I, I know. I know. I worked out with uh, Bruce today. I got back. I got back from New York, and um, we kind of he kind of helped me out and just helped me work work on it, work on it. And I was just kind of just trying to get used to it. And um, yeah, I I, I, got, I think I'm getting better with it with with using the splint. So. <laughs> <laughs> Do you feel like you're in good shape? Like, what, what was your process when you were out? Like, were you able to, you know, get oh, yeah. get runs in? And no, yeah, I, I was I was in good shape. Um, I, I worked out with Scott almost every day, and Scott doesn't doesn't let you take take no breaks. So um, he was with, he was with me throughout the whole time, and uh, helped me help me get get back. Anything else for these guys? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.